Hello family, welcome back to Spend This Avenue. So our next vlog is going to be about Asante Belkwai. So now, travel with me to Asante Belkwai. Bye bye. <laughs> If you have ever visited Asante Bekwai in the Ashanti region of Ghana, you can testify that it is a very nice and busy town. So now, get to know new things about the town through this video. I packed my stuffs and set off. I live closer to the Kamasa International Airport. That's the airport you see over there. This place is called the Airport Runabout. On your left leads you straight to the airport. So now we are heading towards the Chemso. This place is the Chemso. A very busy place as well. We used to call this place on the run, but most people call it Bonjour. Next to it is the Melcom shop. Right from Melcom, we move straight to the Menshe runabout and then the Menshe district hospital. we are at the Menshe District Hospital. It's one of the nicest hospitals we have here in the Ashanti region and in Ghana at large. Now let's move to Dr. Mensa, a name of one of the common and popular places you will hear in Kumasi. Since it's a busy area, the roads and the environment are always busy. I'm moving from Dr. Mensa to Kijetia to board a bus to Bekwai. We are now inside the Kejitia building. This is how the place looks like. In fact, everyone looks busy inside this area. We're moving to the bus station. We are a second closer to the Bekwai station. I paid the fare and then took my ticket. I was so lucky because it was left for just a person for the bus to be full. I got inside the bus and then it set off. <laughs> So this is the Kumasi Cultural Center, also known as the Amamri Fier. Immediately we got there, we saw the police by the roadside. They stopped our car for some checks, so we had to get down. After the checks, we continued our journey. So we moved from there to Suntreso, right from there to North Patase, and then we got to the Bekwai runabout. This road is leading us to Santase. I don't even understand why they named this place Bekwai Runabout. Because moving from this place to Bekwai is almost two hours drive. So I don't understand why they gave the name Bekwai Runabout. Hmm. Anyways, we are Santasi now. In Santasi, you get to see one of the famous restaurants. That is Tasty Queen. And also two senior high schools. That is the Opokoari Senior High School and St. Hilbert Seminary. Before we continue with Santase, there is also this famous senior high school in Patase, that is the Kumasa Senior High Technical School, KSTS. There is the wall of the Pokwari Senior High School. So within Santase, you get to know a town called Enyinem. So now we move from Enyinem to Wahinema Kokobain. Right from Wahinema Kokobain is Trede. Then we move straight to Kuchi and from Kuchi to Nkranza. From Nkwanza, we get to Sabin Akufum. I don't know if I got the pronunciation right, but I'm open for corrections. So we are now at Pechi number two. So many people wonder why Pechi number two comes before Pechi number one, but it all depends on where you are coming from. So when you're coming from Kumasi to be quiet, you will get to Pechi number two before number one. But when you are coming from Obuase, Puano, Bekwai to Kumasi, 
you will get to purchase number one before number two. We are on our way to Adamasu, then from there we get to Anyang Kwanta. So we've moved from Adamasu, and here comes Anyang Kwanta. Anyang Kwanta is a very famous town, known for the making and selling of buffalo. In Ashanti region, when someone mentions Anyang Kwanta, what comes in mind is buffalo. And so Anyang Kwanta is a very famous town in Ashanti region and in Ghana at large. On reaching Anyuan Kwanta, we are almost close to Bekwai. When you get to Anyuan Kwanta, the road on your left is leading to Bekwai, Takrade, and the rest. And the one on your right leads to Puano, Jakubu, Obuase, and the rest. Have a look at the forest you come across. In fact, Ashanti region is blessed. <laughs> So from Anyang Kanta, we get to Abichin, and right from there is Bekwai. So now we are at Sawaba, that's in Bekwai. So this place is the old train station in Bekwai. That has not been in use for some years now. <music> There are a lot of offices, hospitals, and schools you see in Bekwai. This road is leading to the GRA, and that's the signpost you see over there. So this is the office of the GRA. So we are heading to the market place and the bus station. <music> The building you see is the office of the ADB Bank in Bekwai. We are the market place and yet to get to the bus station. You can now testify that Bekwai is a very busy town. We are almost at the bus station. Before you get to the bus station, there is a community information center within the market place. Why information about funerals, missing items, and activities are announced. Here we are at the bus station. These buses travel anywhere inside and outside the quiet. The bus station is very big and the environment is very busy. According to hawkers around this area, they make enough income because there are a lot of people who come around. This nice building you see over there is meant for occasions. There is the signpost of the Wesley Senior High School in Bekwai and also there is the circuit court in Bekwai. This building is the Yengua Hotel and it's a nice place to receive visitors. This place is the Broadway pub where a lot of people have fun. So this is how Bekwai looks at night. Before I forget, we have the SDA Senior High School in Bekwai, the Otun Force 82 Senior High School, and also the Amancia Senior High School. Bekwai is a very nice place, so do well to travel to Bekwai and have fun. Thanks for watching and enjoy the rest of the video. Bye bye! <laughs>